Mark, today I interviewed the widow and the daughter of a Toronto man who has passed away from COVID-19. His name was Mubarak Ali Poppin. He was 77 years old. He died on March 21st after returning to Toronto from the UK. He had gone there because his sister had passed away. And while his wife and his daughter are in mourning, they wanted to share a very important message with everyone. Stay home. He was a truly kind person. He worked at the same place for 40 years, and everybody knew him. He was so humble and so caring of others. He always put others first, and, and that's exactly why we're here, to get his, his message out and his last thank you. Like, he really helped everybody, and, and this was his last way of going, to show, to show an example. That this is a really dangerous virus, you know, and it <laughs> took a life from us. He was having a little heart, uh, like it was pain in the heart. In the chest. In, in yeah. the chest. So he gone to the doctor for physical checkup, just for the physical checkup. So he gone, I didn't touch him, I was away from him because everybody said you have to be isolated. I was listening from the day one. I was listening, we all were obeying that thing because we know that people are saying we have to obey them. There must be some reason, right? So I told him, you go, I'm coming in the Coxville, uh, this thing, emergency. He gone there, then I gone there after that. So he was inside in the isolation room, isolated room, and they told me you can't go in. They stopped me, they said, no, you can't go in because of this reason, we have to check him. It was uh, the first four days when he was isolated inside the hospital, it was fine, he was doing okay. And rapidly after the next three days or so, he, he deteriorated. That's the hardest part. <laughs> it's the hardest part. We have not seen him. They said you can't because you have to be isolated, so I have to listen to them. That's why I'm requesting each and everybody, please be home, be safe. Disease is there, so we don't have to run away from the disease. We have to fight. We have to fight. Just stay home. Stay home. And in stay isolation. And yeah. isolate. Okay. Isolate yourself, please. Mubarak Ali Poppet had been working in the same small grocery store on Gerard Street for the past 44 years. His family says one of the most favorite things that he would do is deliver groceries to seniors.